Hey everybody, I'm Dr. Ozzy with the Functional Medicine and Wellness Center. We're going to dive into a little bit about the theology of the body. Pope John Paul II, the Great, talked about it. And we want to dive into the fact that, you know, the body, the person that created the body heals the body. Obviously that's God and not thinking in terms of the fact that it's not scientific. I mean, God is science, right? So when we start looking at that, we want to understand that we typically as men and women, we start, and human beings, we want to say, well, let's disprove God with science. And really we should be actually looking at how do we prove what uh, God is doing uh, in the Bible, and we can. So many times when we look at so many things I've been doing and practicing over the eight, last 18 years, it just comes back again and again and again and beats me down with, hey, that's right out of the Bible. So for instance, we might start talking about epigenetics, and epigenetics gets into on top of your genes, and it means that the things that you do as a person can have a negative impact. So if I you know, worked in a coal mine and I started having issues with my lungs, that changes the genome or what is the epi on top of my genes, and I can pass that down to the third or fourth generation. And don't we hear that in the Bible that not necessarily that the person was sinning working in the mine, but things that we do to damage our bodies can be passed down to generations. So we see that we manifest that in life, right? So we wanna look at those things and there's many, many more examples. If we start talking about the things that are going on with nutrition, we're supposed to give the land a little break at the seventh year and we don't. So what do we see now? We see depleted soil systems. It takes about 30 elements to make a healthy human and a healthy plant and a healthy animal. We only put about three elements back into the soil to try and push it along. And so now we have depleted soil, depleted plants, depleted animals, now we have depleted people. And we see that where, guess what? Kids and people are breaking down. They're starting to have you know, shoulder surgeries at 17 years old and they're having heart disease and all that. Why? Because they're depleted, right? So we want to make sure that why aren't we giving it? And it comes back to the Bible. If we did what was in there and we stopped messing around, we start seeing the fact that we have soil that actually has what it needs in there to make a healthy human, right? So again, we want to start looking at um, just the theology of the body and making sure that, you know, again, all the science like it backs up, right, what's going on in the Bible. And we can use that and make sure that we're healthy and whole. Uh, our bodies are meant to work. They're meant to be strong. We're meant to have vitality. We're not supposed to just crawl through life, guys, and just kind of slowly go downhill. So uh, health is not the absence of disease, right? That's fine, but we want to be vibrant. We want to have our minds working right. We want to be like everybody in the body, in the Bible, right? They're 100, 110 years old, sound mind, sound body, and they're strong and they're still doing stuff. So again, the body works, the power that created the body heals the body, and we want to remove those roadblocks and we want to use the science to be able to do that again. So Dr. Ozzy with the Functional Medicine and Wellness Center, again, the body works. It's backed up with the theology of the body. Come on in and see us and we'll show you how that works.